Hi team, uh, today we'll learn how to uh, connect SQL Server using JDBC driver. So before that we have to know what is the JDBC. JDBC stands for Java Database Connectivity. So it's established connection within the data source and send queries, update statements and process the results. So it support any kind of uh, app a uh, platform like such as Windows, Mac and Unix and it's established uh, the connection to the database and its object handling the SQL exception, creating the SQL statements, uh, executing queries and retrieving the data and based on our statements. So in this video, uh, first uh, we'll see the steps uh, how we can do that let's see uh, how it's work here is some uh, as you see that it is uh, we'll go for uh, first off in the SQL server eclipse then uh, we'll do uh, download that jdbc driver then we'll connect to the database so here is the steps uh, let's open that uh, url to download that jdbc driver So let me open this. In the real time, I uh, will face a lot of problem like uh, when you're doing the connection so that I will go through a little bit. So here, this one will download and then next. I'm saving this. I already have that. So I'm just showing you how to download now I'll extract I just extracted uh, this one into my under this path so as you see here program file Java and so he, if, when you open you will get another uh, GRE file but you will use uh, for Microsoft 2012 we are using SQL JDBC for JRE. So let me uh, open uh, create one project under so JDBC testing. Uh, I'll create one. Under the JDBC, I'll create another class new. database connection so I'll create this one so okay so now under this uh, we'll associate uh, configure that JDBC JRE file add external so this one I'm adding apply then okay so now uh, we'll do here the connection string. So actually I have, so let me do a little bit and then I'll show see here, uh, this is main method. Under this main method, we'll creating one uh, variable string. that variable name we can give ZDBC so this is our default connection so actually i don't want to uh, type all way so i have one existing one uh, let me copy those or we can work on it so as you see this is what we have to make sure uh, this database connection is uh, uh, local host is uh, into the database we have to make sure that so to do that we have to go our program 
S square is equal to 2012 and then configuration tool SQL configuration yes and as you see here click on so make sure this is enabled yes and IP address as you see all TCP port is 1433 so it is fine and now as see that is also declaring the JDBC objects here and here we are uh, specifying the database name if you go here in the database as you see here my database I specify same in here okay now this will establish the this index will establish the connection and so here is I'm giving the uh, try block if it is connected then it will give the this message or it will uh, throw the exception so I'm uh, passing this uh, Query uh, just a simple select statement as you see here. I have a one table here JDBC test So I'm expecting the information were in under uh, this table. What are the information data it should display into the console? so uh, Now let's uh, run as we already configured that uh, jerry or jdbc driver so let's run it and see what's uh, so we are getting another error failed to load sql jdbc so let me see where is that file i have uh, see this is in here 64 okay so just simply copy this pack and go to the run and run configuration and here we can put the argument and before that we have to write that syntax d java dot library dot path equal to what we copied that path we can give here so now if we run i think it will connect and so something wrong with that could not find the load main class okay let me check again so the java library java okay i'm taking out this and let me see i have another another uh, directory that is in there so here I have Java and JRE version. So let me take this path. So I think because uh, sometime it is giving problem, that's why I'm just keeping it here. So hope it will work now. Okay, let me. I think it will have to do the restart this. Then it will work. So let me run it. So could not find load main class. It is giving error somehow.
I think it is issue in here. Run configuration argument D Java library library dot path equal to I think because of space could be I don't want to keep any space here. Okay. Oh, I have another things called bean. I think that is the mistake. As you see, that bean I didn't click. That's why it's giving problem. Hope this time it will work. Yeah. So as you see here, the record is showing here. Select the start from JDBC test. So I have one record, so that's why it is showing one record, uh, two records. So actually, I put it in here. Uh, how many records here? Yeah, two records. So that this two record is showing. So so this is the way uh, we have to connect to the database using SQL uh, JDBC driver. So thanks. Thanks for watching.